Hi. Bears have a reputation of being savage and rampant. One-on-one -on -one encounter with a grown-up bear is the last thing you'd want to happen to you. For some people, however, a large bear was the last thing they saw. Today you guys will show you some sudden, unexpected wild bear encounters that will take your breath away. These guys must be very brave or foolish if they think that it's fun to tease a bear that big. Look at that massive freaking pile of fat and muscle. I bet that bear has some huge teeth and those claws can rip a little silly human in half. Look at that. He almost hit one of the drivers. So close. Just a few inches away from a brutal death. Matthew Beth from Greenfield in Massachusetts was resting and sleeping by the pool near his house when all of a sudden he got a visitor who went straight to water. I think he probably took a sip or two and then came up to Matthew to say hello. Imagine the sudden rush when the man woke up and saw a bear. Fortunately, it wasn't the kind from the previous video and nobody got hurt or died. If that bear was a little older and hungrier, Matt would become his dinner, no question about it. This video was shot in a province in Russia, some wild area, and so we see a man trying to get away from a bear. He was forced to climb up the tree and the bear went straight after him. It's like he's trying to drop that tree to get to his man. What's funny is that whoever films it acts like it's totally okay and that it's the usual thing that happens every day. He points his camera away and we see a rabbit and a bunch of weird stuff around. It's a good thing that in the end the bear went away and the man could climb down safely. TikTok user Kathleen Nesbitt published a video of a group of people casually having a picnic in a company of a wild bear. We see a big black fellow eating peanut butter sandwiches. How often do you see a wondrous thing like that? It's like a fairy tale scene in real life. It happened near Deep Creek in Maryland. According to locals, this bear is a frequent guest and that he likes to hang out around people because they always have some tasty food he can eat. And this video proves that bears and humans can be good friends. So the bear walks into the room, comes up to a window, and guess what? He hugs a man like they're the best friends in all the world. And then he shows even more love by licking the man's face. How sweet! And here's what happens when innocent games get serious. A video appeared online where a dog is messing with a baby bear. But the dog didn't know there was a large mama bear nearby and that she'd come to protect her little baby. Even though the baby could probably rough up that dog real well itself. And so the video ends abruptly with a massive bear running towards the cameraman and his dog. Hopefully they managed to settle that situation peacefully. Meet Petals, a bear from New Jersey. Paddles has a bit of a problem. He lacks half of his front limb, so it's not convenient for him to move around on all fours. So he had to learn a new way of walking. Pretty smart bear, right? The video was captured by one of the locals who said that people in the neighborhood love Paddles and that they always give him something tasty to eat. Imagine yourself in a corner store, where you shop, minding your own business, and then suddenly you see a massive bear entering the place. What would you do? Poop your trousers, I should imagine. So this bear enters the shop, lays on the floor, eats everything he sees in his sight, but nobody's there to tell him to get lost. Somebody actually slapped him on the butt, but that didn't help much. Somewhere in the US, people saw a bear walk out of the woods. It seems like the bear got interested in their car, and from what we see, he really wanted to get inside of it. It was scratching against the surface, trying to see what's happening inside. 
The bear was there for about five minutes and then went back into the forest. YouTuber Benson Bagley organized a tour along one of the most beautiful biosphere reserves in the world, Yellowstone. They saw Mama Bear with some of her children on the way. Most people hid behind the cars and were making pictures from a safe distance. It's a pretty dangerous situation for those people because those bears are not little and they are wild. With each moment the tension was rising and the Mama Bear felt like she and her little ones were under threat. Luckily, one of the employees had some kind of spray that made the bear step away and leave those people in peace. And then a ranger threw a stone so that the bears went back into the forest. And here we see that a uh, traffic had to be stopped because Mama Bear and three of her babies had to cross the road. For some reason, they really needed to get to the other side. Mother Bear was aware of what was happening around, so she made sure that everybody stopped before she and her kids could go across the street. Fortunately, the whole family got to their destination safely. In the city of Bristol in Connecticut, store clerks noticed a bear and they obviously didn't want it to get in. So the bear was walking around the parking lot and probably remembered he had some shopping to do. Those automatic door sensors noticed movement and opened up, but the bear couldn't get inside the store itself because the clerks noticed it and closed the door. Which is good because otherwise that place would probably get filled with blood and guts and all that good stuff. Seemingly innocent footage almost turned into a tragedy. The man in the car came too close to those bears. There was a large female among the little ones, and because she had to protect her kids, she posed a serious threat to the people inside a car. She was helping one of her babies to climb up when the car came too close. Hopefully the driver will try to be more careful in the future. This guy found himself in a bear trap, quite literally. He was forced to get up that tree to save his life, and if it didn't have that spray, things could turn really ugly for him. As one of the bears tried to climb after him, the man sprayed him, telling to get lost. If it wasn't for the miraculous spray, that man would probably be dead by now. Look at that, guys. In the middle of the forest, with no one around to help, these two cyclists got followed by a ravenous bear. It's possible that he just wanted to play and have fun with the guys. But it's also totally possible that he was very hungry and was planning to chew on those meat and bones he sensed from a distance. Many fun and interesting things happen on a fishing trip. And there are lots of things that people would never believe if they would never saw it on film. So this guy was sitting there, fishing, taking pictures and all of a sudden a bear appeared in the frame. It just came there, sat by the river next to the man, looked in the distance for a short while and went away. Can you imagine what that man felt at that strange moment? What a clever fellow. I have never seen a bear drinking off a bottle so skillfully, like it does that all the time. I wonder if this was a Lipton commercial or just an accident. Anyway, pretty cool bear. That lady in blue pants is so silly, she wanted to take a few pictures with the bear who sat at the side of the road. What was she thinking? It's a pretty large bear. He could tear her apart in an instance. It's a good thing he wasn't too angry and moody at that moment, otherwise the lady would probably be dead by now. This video was shot somewhere in Siberia. Now that's a huge pack of brown bears, and they all walk around some kind of dumpster. The point is that they came dangerously close to humans, and there's a great risk that now a war can happen between bears and humans. And who wants that? No. Our next hero is a definition of a lippy bear. Just think about it. This guy was diligently making that barbecue when all of a sudden a bear came out of nowhere and started stealing his food. 
That's rude. That's unacceptable. Certainly is an, an indecent behavior. What's also funny is that the only sensible thing that came to that man's head is to pour some beer on the bear. Well, can't blame him. I mean, what would you do, guys? So, have you guys ever saw wild animals by accident? How did it happen and who did you see? Tell us all about it. Press the like button if you like this video and we'll see you next time.